What's going on guys? Welcome back. In this video, we'll be going over GTA 5 Online's weekly update, including the sales and best money making methods. So to start us off, we have the Vapid Winky for our podium vehicle. You guys can go ahead over to the casino to spin the lucky wheel to win this vehicle. If you don't mind, drop a like. It'll help the channel out a lot and helps me out a lot. And if you don't mind, turn on that notification bell so you guys don't miss out on the weekly update video. So I ended up getting $40,000 and overall I'm not going to complain. It's better than nothing. So hopefully you guys win that vehicle. And then when we move over to Warstock, we have the mobile operation center on sale. You can get the cab on sale as well as you get the living quarters and every single thing in the base on sale. So you guys might want to get these renovations if you haven't already or if you don't have an MOC, now might be the time. This is a little bit obsolete, but it still has its place in GTA 5. And if you have a lot of extra income, I would definitely recommend picking this vehicle up because it gives you access to some exclusive content. If you guys want to know what my layout is I use the hauler custom as my first and then my bay I use the command center and then the vehicle weapon workshop as my second where it has the combo there so you want the command center in bay one and then in bay two it will take up two bays for bay two we'll take bay two and three for that vehicle and weapon workshop so definitely the way I would lay out my MOC for the best bang for your buck and then if we go over to the rest of the sales, we have the stock aid on sale. I think I'm going to pick this up. I haven't made my decision yet, but for $1 million, it's a $600,000 discount, almost $700,000 discount. I definitely recommend if you guys have extra cash running around, maybe you'll uh, go ahead and pick that up. And then the Night Shark has been in the game for a minute now and it's very useful vehicle especially for those beginners that don't have an armored vehicle. This is actually pretty fast and holds multiple people and has a weapon on the front. So for $747,000 I would not complain if you guys went to pick that up. Then we have the weaponized Tampa on sale. Not a very popular vehicle in GTA 5 Online so I, I don't really recommend this in general if you don't have other vehicles but if you have again extra spare cash you might as well pick it up while it's on sale to add to your collection. And then something to keep in mind this week is Mark II weapon upgrades are going to be on sale so you guys can upgrade all your weapons for half off instead of paying the full price you'll get 50% off your Mark II weapon upgrade which is quite a significant discount you're thinking like hundred thousand dollars you're getting fifty thousand dollars each weapon upgrade and this is actually worth it the ones I recommend the most to you guys is the special carbine I like to mark to as well as the shotgun pump and the uh, heavy sniper rifle mainly because the heavy sniper rifle and the shotgun pump they actually have explosive rounds if you do the research um, so definitely something I would recommend I love those two weapons as well as the special carbine mark 2 variant is probably my favorite assault rifle in the game hands down so those are the ones I would pick up if you are on limited budget but if you guys are just trying to upgrade all your weapons now would be the time to do so so you guys can save some cash and then next we have probably the better portion of the update we have the money making methods and this is gun running supplies last week it was two times money on gun running supplies this week's a little bit different so instead of it being two times money they're giving us a discount on resupply so when you buy supplies it's 50 percent off at thirty seven thousand five hundred dollars now this this is significant you guys don't realize how significant this is because for those that have the upgrades on their bunker you can actually buy supplies and be profitable but now you can be even more profitable because you have the supplies at 50% off so I recommend everyone instead of stealing your supplies just to click resupply and uh, buy those supplies instead of doing those missions and then we have the research now I'm not hundred percent sure on this so you know double check in the comment section below maybe you guys will correct me if I'm wrong but I I believe research is two times the speed now generally speaking I don't recommend you guys do research or wait for research um, I recommend you buy supplies let it like build up just a tiny bit and then fast track it for 200,000 it's not on discount to fast track it but I have heard that it's going to be two times the speed for your research so if you guys want to do the research the old uh, tried and true method I'm not a huge fan of it but if you guys want to now would be the time to do so if it is actually two times the research 
And that brings us to our next money making method, which is Motor Wars for the second week in the row. I love Motor Wars. And if you guys can get this video to 3000 likes, I will do a live stream at some point this week with you guys, helping you guys make money by using this money making method, maybe some KO Perico heist. So don't forget again to leave a like on this video so we can have that live stream. I'm really hoping that we end up doing that this week because that would be pretty cool. But if you guys haven't played this before, you pretty much dive down into like a war zone. It's really, really Really similar to Apex or Fortnite or Call of Duty Warzone, whatever you want to call it, where you go ahead and compete and then you can play multiple rounds and fight each other. I didn't show a whole bunch of gameplay because I don't want to waste you guys' time, but I played two rounds. We won only two rounds and we ended up winning $81,000. So you guys can bring in quite a bit of cash this week. Um, I know if you play three rounds, even four rounds, you can make up to $100,000, $150,000. And then our next money making method is our mobile operation center is two times money for these missions. I don't like these, I'm not a fan, mainly because you need two people to complete them, but it's okay if you are trying to get the discount, you might as well do the discount missions now. And these are available in your MOC. And then last but not least, we have this week's time trial, which is Lake Vinewood Estates. I like this time trial, it's fairly easy once you get the hang of it. But there are a few tips that will help you be successful in completing this time trial. You do have one minute and 26 seconds to complete the time trial to beat the part time to get the $100,000 reward. So if you follow my path, you will probably be quite successful. So I always recommend you wheelie when you're trying to actually uh, gain speed and you're not in danger of crashing you can always wheelie pull back on that left thumbstick and get as much speed as possible but someone the other day told me or brought to my attention that you can push forward and this is true you can but it's not as fast so i always do recommend wheeling but the advantage to pressing forward is the difference in acceleration isn't that much and you'll be able to maintain control so wheelie when you are definitely safe to and then when you can't or don't feel safe to press forward and then you're just going to want to follow this path it's fairly simple as long as you follow my path watch this like once or twice and you'll definitely be successful so one of the things i wanted to mention is when when you're going up this hill you might want to consider slowing down so you don't crash uh, when you land if you go full speed you will probably fall off your bike and die even if you land slightly off tilt you will die and then when you're going on this uh, bridge here you're gonna want to wheelie as much as possible and try not to slow down and just take this right up into the air you could slow down and reduce your airtime you probably get a little bit of speed but I think the distance you get out of it is uh, overall the best and just try to follow the dirt road and you will win it's fairly fairly simple overall it took me three attempts and that was with uh, me messing around with my brother and we ended up getting that hundred thousand dollar reward so if you like the video please don't forget to drop a like on this video because I really do want to do that live stream. Comment what your favorite money making method for this week was and don't forget to subscribe as always thanks for watching